Have you ever heard of superposition? Not yet? Then let us introduce you to Schrödinger's cat. The inventor of this cat, Erwin Schrödinger, was an Austrian physicist who developed a thought experiment with a cat in 1935. Let us assume that the mentioned cat is in a box. In this box, one also finds a small amount of radioactive substance a detector, a hammer and a jar with poison. The dangerous thing about the items is probably the fact that they can be considered a ticking time bomb. The radioactive substance can either remain intact or decay within an hour. As soon as the atom decays, the decay is registered by the detector. This moves the hammer, which then destroys the jar containing the poison. You can already guess, the cat dies. As long as the box is not opened, the cat is in an overlapping state. In a way, it is dead and alive. This state is called superposition. Just as with the cat, superposition also exists with quanta. They can be in several states at the same time. This is actually unimaginable. According to the rules of quantum mechanics, the state of the quantum is only unambiguously defined. Like with a cat, when the box is opened, in other words, when a measurement is carried out. Luckily, this is only a thought experiment because quantum phenomena only take place in the world of the very small and the cat is therefore saved. The incredible thing is that superposition of quanta actually takes place and not only in thought experiments. We are just discovering how we can use phenomena like superposition. For example, for quantum computers, quantum sensors or for encrypting messages. Find out how in our videos.